are all right. Well, one of the things that I've had uh, people come across is, you know, when they're doing stuff for their website or they just happen to need to, you know, create a JPEG or some sort of GIF file uh, in order to send something through email or so it's easily read, you can, uh, you can use PowerPoint and to very, very easily and very simply uh, create a JPEG. So we're going to do that real quick here. So I have PowerPoint open. You know, for the sake of doing something, let's uh, we'll just do a little happy birthday, uh, happy birthday card. So you know, put a little background in this. Uh, we'll go a little word art. Insert word art. Happy birthday. You know, PowerPoint. Let's do some text effects. We'll get a little, you know, a little tricky with it. Create it up so nice, look a little bit bigger. Spin. Uh, put a picture in real quick. Might as well just use some clip art. We have birthday. Uh, yeah. A little birthday cake. And we always want to wish our mother's happy birthday so that's what we'll go with happy birthday mother make it a little bigger for us marry it maybe uh, maybe a little glow alright that didn't glow didn't seem to go but all right, so now we have a quick, simple, you know, slide that we created. Uh, you know, this could be a party, you know, a party invitation, uh, you know, a flyer or anything. And uh, you know, now you want to send it out, but uh, you don't want to send it as a PowerPoint file because one, not everybody has PowerPoint, and it's a little more convenient if you just uh, shoot it out as a JPEG. So all you do is as simple as this: file, save as. Big important thing is right here find JPEG, find it, let's put this on the desktop, we'll call it happy birthday, and we saved. Very important right here, you just want to do a current slide only, you hit it, doesn't look like you did anything, but when you come up and you find your desktop, you should see Happy birthday, and there it is as a JPEG in easy, able to view. So very quick, very easy JPEG creation.